in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys five brand new secrets in Brookhaven. These secrets are really, really cool. So make sure you guys stay till the end and make sure you drop a like and a sub with post notifications. I'd really appreciate it. I also have a Discord link in the description, so if you guys want to join that as well. Anyway, I'm not going to hold you guys any longer. We're going to get straight into it. Okay guys, so for the first couple secrets, you want to make your way all the way towards the hotel. This hotel has a lot of hidden secrets, so I'm going to show you guys every single secret right now, so don't worry. I am very sorry for the people that don't own the hotel because the hotel is actually IRL money, so if you guys want to purchase the hotel, you're going to need the real estate pack, but if you guys don't have it, don't worry because I have a lot of free secrets in this video, so keep watching the whole video through. Anyway guys, make your way all the way inside of the hotel. Make sure you guys have a flashlight because it is very dark where we're going to be going. Make your way all the way towards the kitchen and go in this little hole right here and it drops you down and as you guys can see right now we're in a little hole and it's really cool guys it's actually really really cool okay guys so for the next secret inside of the hotel you guys are going to want to make your way all the way towards upstairs and once you guys are upstairs you can go in any single room you want it doesn't really matter i'm not going to lie hands down this has to be the best secret inside of this hotel but anyway once you guys are inside of the room go near this dresser in this photo right here and you guys are going to want to jump up once you guys jump up as you guys can see you're in kind of like an attic or whatever you want to call it a closet back rooms whatever you want to call it and you can see up there there's actually a vent but don't worry guys this secret actually gets very cool so once you guys walk straight you keep teleporting and once you guys keep teleporting the vents move and you're actually in a different room as you guys can see I went into the green room which is the emerald room and now we are in the pink room which is the rose room and if you guys keep doing that you go from room to room to room so you basically teleport into each other's room every single room in the hotel you can get to from here so it's really cool see now we're in like the purple bluish room so that's really really cool guys okay guys so for the last and final secret inside of the hotel don't worry we have a lot more secrets where that came from you guys are going to want to go inside of the elevator and go up and then go down once you guys go down you are going to be in the secret room where the secret safe is i hope you guys know about this because this is a little bit old since the update dropped or whatever but yeah guys you guys can come in here and if you get close over here you actually start swimming and if you want to leave you guys can actually just go straight up Press this button right here on the wall, jump up, and you guys are out. Okay, guys, so for the fourth secret, what you guys are going to want to do is go to downtown Subway. Once you guys are down here, I'm going to explain everything. It's kind of like a two-part thing because I'm going to show you guys two secrets down here, but I'm going to count it as one, so that's an extra secret for you guys. But anyway, make sure you got your flashlight and everything because it is pretty dark where we're going. But go right here, guys, on this downtown station subway sign. You're going to want to press it. Once you guys press it, there's going to be a secret door that opens, and inside here is really cool guys you're basically under the map where you spawn in and you can actually go inside of here so now you are under the fountain where you spawn in and the water actually looks pretty clear and pretty realistic i'm not gonna lie um and then you can walk this whole thing just jump walk this whole thing there is going to be a couple sides that are pretty solid like these sides right here these walls right here are pretty solid but these you can walk straight through and if you guys want to get out, you guys can actually get out with pressing this button right here. And you can get out, basically. But you can't go back in. So right here, um, I'm going to show it. It has to close really quick. Uh, once it closes, as you guys can see, you can't get back in. You have to press the button again. So make sure you guys press the button. And don't just come over here and say it's fake. Because obviously, it's not going to let you in. You have to press the button first. And then you get let in like that. Okay, guys, I know I only said five secrets, but I'm going to throw an extra one in for you guys. Do not worry. So basically what you guys are going to want to do is get a property and spawn this house right here, this wooden looking house. This secret, it's not like the coolest, but it, it's kind of cool. I mean, I found it out by myself and you basically jump through the floor. I'm going to show you guys. Wait till your whole house, uh, you know, loads in and everything. Okay. My trash PC, okay, everything's loaded in. Alright, guys, so once you guys are, everything's loaded in, you guys are going to want to go to the living room. Go stand right here on this couch. Once you guys stand on this couch, you guys are going to want to jump and press E. So jump and press E, guys. And then when you jump and press E, you basically go through the floor, and now you are upstairs. It's really cool, so if you're trying to run away from somebody or something, and they think you disappeared, but you really didn't, you literally just jump right here, press E. Uh, sometimes it doesn't work. Okay, press E, and there you go. Now we are basically upstairs. It's really cool. Okay, guys, so for the fifth and last secret, you guys are going to want to get a vacant property. Once you guys get a vacant property, get the brand new house that was added in the update and wait for it to load in. Once it loads in, guys, you guys are going to want to go straight upstairs in the elevator. All right, let's wait for it to load in really quick. 
all right it finally loaded in so you guys are going to want to go upstairs in the elevator and this plant right here you guys are going to want to click it once you guys click it as you guys can see the secret safe is right there but after a while it does close so you guys are going to want to get in there fast so we're going to go run over there right now and right now you can actually close it while you're in here so if someone's trying to kill you or something you guys can actually open the secret compartment your safe is right here you'll be safe with your safe get what i did there safe and safe yeah um, but yeah, guys, you guys are going to want to stay in here or whatever. If you guys want to get out, you guys can obviously get out with that button right there and it will close by itself and you're basically safe.